I'm not angry. Well, you should be, because you're never playing competitively again. Uh, I, I don't agree with that assessment. Joe, give this cunt the stiff. No tengo un stiff. You've got your hat, don't you? Bully. Oh! What's up, big boys, and welcome to the LA Galaxy Rescue. Donovan comes out of retirement episode. The American hero has freaking unretired. Landon Donovan, one of the most unlikely scenarios that anyone could have possibly seen, uh, has come out of retirement, has signed a contract to play for the LA Galaxy for the remainder of the year, and is going to be hopefully helping to turn some of those draws. They have like a record, like 14 draws in 28 matches. Hopefully going to try and turn some of those draws into wins. But absolutely freaking incredible that Donovan, who spent 10 years with L the LA Galaxy, a couple of those on loan to um, Everton, was it Everton and Bayern, I'm pretty sure? He is going to be joining his teammates Robbie Keane, freaking Steven Gerrard, who I believe is injured. Uh, De Jong, I believe, has gone to Galatasaray, but we just want to include him in the squad. We've got Clint Dempsey, who's going to be a league mate now. The two of them will be freaking united, which is emotional in its freaking own right. Couple things about Donovan you might not know. The MLS MVP trophy is called the Landon Donovan MVP trophy. So what happens if he freaking wins it? Is it the Landon Donovan wins the Landon Donovan MVP trophy? That sounds a little freaking weird. Also, he had a kid when he retired, and he decided... Decided to name his kid Talon. He decided to name his kid after a freaking raptor clock. This has nothing to do with Landon Donovan, but Robbie Keane can actually sing really freaking well. The guy's a beast. In other news, boys, the FIFA 17 demo is coming out the 13th. EA confirmed that it is coming out the 13th, so I can't wait to get that. Get into a foot draft, see what the journey looks like, see what some of the uh, squad building challenges look like. Gonna be absolutely freaking incredible. The 13th is when it comes out. Can't freaking wait. Haven't used Jared at Striker in quite some time, and obviously, whenever I put an MLS side together, it's really difficult because there's so many freaking legends. We've got uh, Piatti, who's team of the season card. I don't believe I've used him yet. Looks absolutely incredible. We've got Giovanni Dos Santos, who we might bring in four star week, but four star skill moves. Doesn't look like a card that should be 79 rated. His stats make him look like a card that should be like 84. We've got David Villa, we've got Drogba, Giovinco, and Kaká. But this is the squad we're going to roll with. Robbie Keane, an Irish legend. He retired from the international side. He retired from Ireland, did not retire from the Galaxy. Uh, but uh, yeah, just an absolutely freaking incredibly emotional side right here. We got Timmy Howard in net. Question of the episode, has there ever been a legend player in FIFA that's come back. I mean, I know we've only had legends for like two or three years, but I don't think it's ever, uh, it's never happened before. Like a legend card is meant for a player that is retired. Landon Donovan is coming out of retirement. Like what happens? How does he go from having an 86 legend card in FIFA 16 to having just like a normal card in FIFA 17? But anyway, boys, if you guys do enjoy the episode, hit that like button, let's try and blast. And I want to say 80 likes for Landon Donovan's FIFA 17 card rating. As well, if you guys want to interact with me on Instagram and Twitter, those links can be found in the description below, boys. Alan Pardew in the MLS. I mean, what would he do in the MLS? He's flying on an eagle. Wearing the 100% smack my bitch at bonus turn. All right, boys, here we go. Match number one coming up against Costa. We've got Mictarian, United City Derby. Donovan comes out of retirement. Flawless victory. Wait, am I getting a red right now? Oh shit, no card. Dude, I slid freaking feet first into his keeper on purpose. No freaking card. PK and freaking Donovan last one. He's dead fishing in front of PK, bros. Come on. He should have defended better. He should have defended better on that absolute freaking smash from the dawn. He's got the little red riding hood boots. He just ball rolls him. I'm not sure that was PK. That actually might have been Ramos. Was that Ramos? The freaking Steven Gerrard freaking ball rolled? Boys, the game started out so freaking slow and now it just heated up big time. <sighs> All right, that was nice. I'll give it to him. I played, it was shit defending on my part, but it was a nice goal. Halftime, 11 shots, four on target. 51% possession. Holy shit, you know what? The first matches I've played in episodes recently, I've not been playing too well in, but this one I feel like I have in control. I feel like I actually could possibly win this one 4-1. Bobby Keane! Come on! The Irish ledge! Going for your close-up! Oh, that, that, I'm, I'm trying to get the close-up, dude. Robbie Keane is a crazy looking guy, dude. He looks like a freaking, very intimidating, figure inside the game. What a freaking rip! 
from the singing Irishman, bro. And that's game, boys. He took a chance to bring him out and just didn't clear it well enough. That's one of the first times I've scored a goal like that from an errant uh, keeper clear. Donovan, two goals, almost has himself a hat trick, four goals. This guy's getting freaking crushed. What a shit effort from his keeper. I mean, he tried getting back there, but what the hell? All right, now th this is the rage quit. This is the actual rage quit. Oh shit, this is a Wembley. This is like my Wembley cup. <laughs> and he it in, and there's the goal. And that's it. Oh, Sergio Ramos! Shit! Donovan Hattrick outside the box. Mm, shit, 90th minute. Doesn't look like it's gonna happen, boys. But we do get ourselves a 4 1 freaking victory. And there you have it, boys! Match number one in the freaking books! 4 1 decisive victory, 9.7 for Donovan, two goals, a goal for Stevie G, and a goal for Robbie freaking Keane. Oh shit, boys! I'm coming up against the full Mexican side! I feel like I have to bring on mine. If he's gonna play a Dos Santos, I feel like I have to play mine. Who should, dude, do I take him off? Do I take Dems off? Shit, no, Dos Santos is a striker, though. Dude, you know what? I'm taking Stevie... I'm taking Stevie G off, just for this match. Cause that's freaking emotional. We have to bring on Dos Santos. Or is he gonna fucking, is he gonna score me right now? We have one chance right here, boys! And that's it, boys, Stevie G is off. I think he only has like 81 long shots, but he makes the freaking count. Beautiful layoff pass from, I think that was De Jong. Little ball roll from freaking uh, Robbie Keane, and then the left to right spin. The freaking side spin he puts on that ball was nuts. <laughs> what the hell is calling me, dude? 955? Donovan, this is it. Such a sick goal! Dude, Dos Santos is doing some stuff that I have not seen recently. At halftime, boys, an incredibly, incredibly close match. Dos Santos has been close. He's come close to doing some freaking gang stuff. Let's see if we can get the second half. Let's see if we can get freaking Dos Santos' first goal. Why did he not just completely bury- Like, he had that chance to just bury that shot. Does he just not have good volley? playing the violin for me, dude? You playing the violin? I'll fucking play a violin for you right now, dude. beating Jermaine Joes, one of the more physical players in the game. Let's go. Beautiful touch. Robbie Keane does not miss that, boys. 3-2, 68th minute. That could be the game winner right there. But leave it to Robbie Keane not to freaking miss on an opportunity like that. There you have it, boys! Match number two in the freaking books! That one looked a little rocky. Looked like I was gonna come up against a really good opponent. Another match, 9.4 for Donovan. Doesn't even get himself a goal. But Robbie Keane, eight, how does Robbie Keane only get 8.4? Scored two absolute freaking bangers. Legend Donovan, out of retirement. Hopefully you guys did enjoy the episode. Um, incredible, incredible performance. Anytime I play with an MLS side, I'm always just like so surprised by some of the performances that I get in. Like, yes, Donovan's a, a legend card, but like an 86 overall. I mean, put, to put that in perspective, you have a lot of players in FIFA that are over the uh, the rating of 86 that have better stats, but Donovan played really, really freaking well. But anyway, boys, if you guys did enjoy the episode, hit that like button. If you guys are new to the channel, hit that subscribe button down below. I will see you guys for another upload tomorrow. Till next time, tschüss, later, ade. I foresee an era without PK. Hell yeah, bro!